If you're a childhood Ninja Turtles fan like me, then you likely had the same reaction that I did when I loaded up Shredder's Revenge, which was, where's Casey Jones? Everyone's favorite sports enthusiast slash vigilante is in the game, but for some reason, he's not a selectable character when you start. I'm Jamie Latour, and I'm going to show you how to unlock Casey Jones in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge. Now I've got some very good news for you, and that's that unlocking Casey Jones isn't too hard. All you gotta do is beat the game. That's right, that's it. Just get through all 16 levels, including the final level, Wrath of the Lady. You'll get some cutscenes immediately afterwards, featuring the punk frogs and a celebratory pizza party. And my god, look how excited Master Splinter is about that sushi platter. After these little cutscenes, the end credits will start, and you can't skip through them, but you can hold the A button to speed them up, which is appreciated. At the end of the credits, you'll see the words Kawabunga, thank you for playing, and afterwards, you'll be informed that you've unlocked Casey Jones. Casey's a lot of fun to play with, and he's also a good choice to tackle the game's level challenges as he's slightly more powerful than the other characters. That's because he gets seven stars to spread out across his stats as opposed to six like everyone else. This gives him three stars in range and two stars in power and speed. This doesn't make him too OP, but he is statistically better than all four turtles, April and Splinter. Which is fair, because Casey Jones is the best. So now you have access to the best character in Shredder's Revenge. It may be cool to beat up foot soldiers with swords, nunchucks, and, uh, video, camera, and microphone? Is she reporting on this fight? But there's something truly satisfying about fighting crime with golf clubs, hockey sticks, and basketballs. All that's missing is a cricket bat. For more Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge news and guides, check out thegamer.com. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.